Hello, everybody. Welcome back. We're on part three of Let's Make an Eclipse. Remember in part two, what kind of eclipse did Amy and her mom and dad make? What kind of eclipse do you remember? Majao, solar eclipse, right? Ilshik. That is different from this. Before we saw the sun, the moon, and the earth. But now, earth and moon, pakwa heseo. Chigam pakwa heseo. Now, we will learn about walshik. Okay? Let's read together. Move the melon in front of the orange, said mom, in front of. So before chane, the melon is here, the orange is here. But now pakwaheo, move the melon in front of the orange. So pakwa, right? So now the melon is in front of the orange. And now look. Wow, the shadow covers the whole moon, right? The whole orange. Look at the shadow the melon makes on the orange. The shadow makes on the orange. The melon makes a shadow on the orange. Here is the sun. Here is the light. The earth, or the melon, blocks that light for the whole moon. So, where do we live? Do we live on the moon? No. Whew. Thank goodness we would die. <laughs> we live on the earth. Think about this. We live here. We can see the moon. What does it look like? When this happens, during Walshik, what does the moon look like? It is like the shadow Earth makes on the moon in a lunar eclipse. Walshik, right? In a lunar eclipse. It covers the whole moon. The Earth's shadow covers the whole moon. So what does it look like? Earth's shadow is here. Here's the moon. And then the moon looks like this. Oh, right? Normally, botonge, usually, the moon is white, very bright white in the sky. But during a lunar eclipse, Wolshik Day, the moon becomes red. Oh. I saw a lunar eclipse several years ago in America. So, Earth moves between the sun and the moon. Here is the Earth. Here is the moon. There is the sun. Sun Moon, Earth. Earth is between, between, sai, the sun and the moon. It makes a shadow on the moon. It blocks the light and it covers the whole moon. Earth's shadow covers the whole moon, the whole moon, all of it, tayo. Right? Not part, not chokumshik, but ta yo, all of it. The whole moon. The moon looks, it looks dark red. Wow, very interesting color, very strange. Yi sang heo, but chemi right? So, Amy learns how to make an eclipse. From her mom and dad. She learns about solar eclipse, right? Ilshik. And she learns about 
lunar eclipse, Walshik, right? What does she do? Amy went to school, right? Hakkyo kaseyo, right? She went to school. She, she, Amy, showed her class how to make an eclipse too. Here is Amy. Here is her classmate. He's holding, what is he holding? He's holding a flashlight. Yes. What is Amy holding? In her right hand, she's holding an orange. What is the orange? The orange is the moon, Majel. In her left hand, Wenchok Sun, what is she holding in her left hand? It's the melon. What is the melon? The melon is the earth, Majel, the earth. And here we can see the shadow. What is the shadow? The shadow is Ilshik, Majayo, Ilshik, because it's blocking the light on the earth. That's Ilshik. Pandero, if it's the earth is blocking the orange, we say Walshik, lunar, lunar eclipse. So Tashi, Hanban. Solar eclipse, Solar eclipse, ilshik, solar, solar eclipse. Pandero, walshik is lunar, lunar eclipse. So remember, solar is the sun, lunar is the moon. Now you know how to make an eclipse. So, why don't you say to your friends, let's make an eclipse. What do you need? You need a flashlight, you need an orange, and you need a melon. The flashlight is the sun, the orange is the moon, and the melon is the earth. Majayo. So, let's make an eclipse. Okay, that finishes our book and our lesson for today. I hope it was interesting. I thought, wow, no mo chemi soil. Very interesting. Okay, we'll see you next time. Take care.